The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the WWE World Heavyweight Champion, Seth Rollins. You know, I hate to be so negative, but this guy deserves every last boo he gets here tonight. I can't wait to see what happens when the bell rings and these two finally get to go at each other. And approaching the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota, we need a 286 pounds, Brock Lesnar. Here he comes, 6'3", 266 pounds, Whoa. just look into his eyes. Brock Lesnar's a beast. Yeah, facing Lesnar is definitely not for the faint of heart. He's a great one. Whoa, looking to be in phenomenal shape heading into this one. Are you kidding me? Look! And Rollins with the reversal. Nice escape by Lesnar. And it's moves like that that made Lesnar the one in 21 and 1. It looks like that back is under a great deal of stress right now. Quick thinking to avoid that. Huge power move. What do you have on Brock Lesnar? Looking fresh right now, which is good. You gotta wonder how much longer that can last, though. Oh, out of nowhere! Oh! We're seeing two outstanding athletes looking to prove their dominance in there. But only one can walk out victorious. Who will it be? Let's talk some history, King. June 24, 2002. On Monday Night Raw, Brock Lesnar has coronated the WWE King of the Ring. Lesnar wins the tournament. And then the next night, his manager, Paul Heyman, asks everyone to get up from their seats and applaud Lesnar. Oh, Cole, I remember that night. And Lesnar being coronated was a historic event for WWE and Monday Night Raw. I just got to tell you, any time that no good idiot Paul Heyman is involved in something, I think it just gets ruined. To me, Heyman stinks. And now it's Seth Rollins with momentum. Well, Brock Lesnar being coronated King of the Ring in 2002 was a major event for two reasons. One, King of the Ring is a prestigious title for any WWE superstar to enjoy. And two, it meant that Lesnar was the number one contender for the WWE Championship. And his match was set against the champion during that time, The Rock. Here's the cover. And a kick out. And that's all that matters. This match continues. You need to park a truck on top of Brock to keep him down. 
My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here. Lesnar. Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. Seth Rollins displaying an unreal will to win here tonight. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Michael, any way you look at it, Brock Lesnar coronated as the 2002 King of the Ring was major WWE history. I can speak firsthand to the benefits of being royalty, and I think when Brock Lesnar was coronated King, it gave him even more of a feeling that he can do what he wants, when he wants. Three. And Rollins with the reversal. Look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. Four. Five. I got to tell you, these guys are in the best shape I've Six. ever seen them in. Seven. Bringing it back between the ropes. And that's a good thing. the emotion. We all know the amazing array of moves Seth Rollins has at his disposal to decimate an opponent. What does that tell you about his finishing move? It's a brutal move, driving a man's skull to the mat. What we're witnessing here is surreal. What a reversal. We're looking at complete domination here. You're going to want to avoid that knee. Both of these competitors have so much resolve, it's going to take a minor miracle to keep one of them down. One, two. Michael, we have to face facts. The pure cruelty Seth Rollins exudes when he's looking to finish off an opponent. I mean, it's scary. I don't know about you, but I can't think of anything I'd rather be doing on this. And he goes for the pin. There's the count. And now he goes for it a second time. Oh, and he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The breeze may give him a cold. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The pedigree, this one is in the books. Pedigree to perfection. Finisher, this match. Looking for all the glory here. I just can't get over the physicality of this match. This has been brutal. Brutal and very, very painful for these guys. We're looking at complete domination here. Lesnar with a nice reversal. We're looking at what a counter that was. Not today, too fast. Oh, wow. We now have to question if he'll be able to come back after that. Covers. The damage has been done. We're seeing some truly amazing moves in this match. And into the cover. The ref gets absolutely flattened. Just a dominating display. Yeah, I think we could see a lot of punishment inflicted here. 
Wow, that overhand punch started down behind his feet and just kept coming. Brock Lesnar delivering crippling punishment. Look at Brock Lesnar pouring on the aggression. Whoa, show that move to anyone thinking. Will this be enough? Hang on. It's over. It's all over. Oh, boy. That was a spectacular. And here's some highlights from the matchup. Look at this. I can't believe what we just saw. Here's your winner, Brock Lesnar. A big singles victory here tonight. Sometimes you step into the ring and, well, just refuse to lose. I think that's what we saw here in this match. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big singles win here tonight.